average person, who the most capable people are, who the most apt people are, more than likely they're going to say white males. Black people are disenchanted with how things are in the black community. But my video on white men wasn't a diss to the black community. It was really me sharing how and why white men have earned my respect and how and why I would, in many cases, prefer to deal with them than to deal with people from other walks of life. I'm a black woman. politically correct to speak well as white men. And I'm not talking about YouTube. I'm talking about reality. In the real world, it is not politically correct to say anything nice about white men. It's really not PC to say anything nice about black women either. So a lot of people are following that tidal wave and they're bashing black women. That's what you're supposed to be. You be doing. You're supposed to be bashing black women and a lot of people do that. For the last 30 years or so, black women have used every platform and every opportunity to bash black men. Now, there isn't necessarily anything wrong with that. You know, if that's their experience, then perhaps, you know, that's something that they want to talk about or they have a right to talk about. But the problem is, or the problem has been, that black men have not been allowed to express their grievances um, with black women in any public forum. For example, there are no TV programs dedicated to men's issues. For example, there is no Oprah Winfrey for men. So what's happened over the last 30 years is we've had a completely one-sided perspective, i.e. a female perspective. Mm -hmm.